Hey guys, I, I just wanted to do a quick video. We all know now that the hurricane model for Dorian um, is has projected it, the, the path to come upwards, uh, northwards uh, through Georgia, South Carolina, and Wilmington, not Wilmington, but North Carolina, which we are obviously in that direct path and possibly even Virginia. So I just wanted to shoot you out a quick video. Um, we all know that this projection is several days out. It may change again. It very likely will at some point, whether it's the direction or the intensity. And, you know, it very well may not hit us at all. So it's definitely too far out for us to panic. Um, but it is a good reminder that you should always have an emergency preparedness kit on hand, both in your vehicle and also in your home. I'm going to do a video later about what that kit should look like and you'll be able to see a list of those items, but don't wait for my video to come out. Just go online and do some Googling and do some advanced planning and make sure that you are ready. We all remember what happened during Florence and the devastation that it caused to this area. Thankfully, we live in a fantastic community where everybody came together and we we recovered, you know, quite quickly. I mean, it seemed like forever, but relatively, we actually rebounded quite quickly and did well. We're all super proud of our community and our family members and, you know, our coworkers and everybody that helped during that recovery effort. Um, but just wanted to throw this out there. You do see it coming up and some people are starting to panic and worry. You definitely should be prepared. Um, if, if your house is listed, you might want to contact your listing agent and see what their plans are um, as far as, you know, like say things, little things that you wouldn't even think about because you're thinking of more important items like your food and your medicine. But your real estate agent needs to be worrying about things like, you know, the for sale sign that's in front of your yard so the wind doesn't make it a projectile and cause injury to someone's property or even people. Um, your real estate agent can also lead you, um, refer you to contacts who would be able to help you with boarding up windows, trimming tree limbs, those types of things that help you be more prepared during the storm. So if you need those types of resources, always, always contact your real estate agent. We're a fabulous um, source of information as well as we have many, many contacts in many, many, many different fields. So reach out to them and see how they can help you get prepared as well. But again, don't panic. We're several days out. Keep an eye on the weather. Be prepared. Um, get an evacuation plan in place if necessary. Uh, but for the most part, I personally think we're going to be fine, and I hope that we are. But if we do happen to run into a bad situation, I know my family is going to be prepared, and I hope that yours is as well. If you have any questions on being prepared, or if you need advice or any type of resources for getting prepared, go ahead and give me a call. 910-200-7715. Talk to you later, and stay safe. But for the most part, have a great Memorial Day weekend. I'm sorry, Labor Day weekend. Have a great Labor Day weekend. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.